England vs Australia Live. Result and reaction as Ollie Watkins goal secures three Lions victory. England edged past Australia in an international friendly at Wembley to keep their recent winning run alive and give them a touch of momentum heading into a crucial Euro 2024 qualifier against Italy next week. After Gareth Southgate named an inexperienced starting eleven to take on the Socceroos, the three Lions took their time to settle. The controlled possession but failed to make much of an impact in the first half with Ollie Watkins, leading the line in the absence of Harry Kane, missing two great chances. At the other end of the pitch, Australia should have gone ahead through Ryan Strain whose sto from the right side of the box was beautifully kept out by a back-tracking Lewis Dunk. After the break things were different. England upped the tempo and operated higher up the pitch. Trent Alexander-Arnold found Jack Grealish in the box and the Man City man picked out Watkins at the far post who tapped in the winner. Ollie Watkins and Lewis Dunk emerge with credit on England's audition night against Australia. 22-17. Mike Jones. On a night billed as an audition for England's fringe players, with only five more games before Gareth Southgate names his Euro 2024 squad. Ollie Watkins and Lewis Dunk were the two who emerged with credit from this unconvincing 1-0 friendly win over Australia. Watkins tapped in the winning goal just before the hour to push his claim for a role as poacher. Dunk had earlier prevented a certain goal at the other end and is emerging as a much-needed new character in central defence to partner John Stones. But elsewhere there were some fluffed lines, and perhaps Gareth Southgate's main learning was that for all the quality in their ranks, England are not quite the same without Harry Kane, Jude Bellingham and their handful of leading lights. Levi Colwill was understandably nervous on his Egnall end debut and conceded possession too easily. Trent Alexander-Arnold had limited impact in his hybrid fullback Mittefeld role. And it was a rough night for Jordan Henderson, England's captain, who had little effect on the match and left the pitch after an hour to loud boos around Wembley. It was certainly jarring to see Al Etifak on the team sheet beside his name, and England fans presumably don't buy his claim that he moved to Saudi Arabia to grow the game and change attitudes from the inside. Thanks for watching NY Sports News. Stay tuned for more updates.